beer o'clock on Real Craft Beer. Got a collaboration brew with Joppen and Lurvig, and it's a bottle of the Don't Rye This at Home. So it's a barrel aged rye wine at 13.3% ABV. We're at the wonderful, this is the last review of the year for the Wrocław Beer Festival. Wonderful day for it, beautiful weather, uh, hence the sunglasses. Little mild breeze, perfect for a for a beer review. So it is the bottle cap. Let's get the beer out into a glass and see what we get. Nice bit of smoke on the opening. Beer in the glass then. Yeah, looks like a typical barley wine, good colour. Good head for a 13.3% ABV beer. Two fingers of foamy tang colored head, but very impressed with that. It looks like he wants to stick around as well. Uh, good levels of carbonation. Can't quite see. It's quite, it's a, it's a little hazy. But yeah, it looks very nice in the glass. Let's uh, dive in and get the aroma. And this dark rye colored ale. Yeah, you get the, it's almost, I, I see why they call it a rye wine. The alcohol, the 13% ABV is very typical for the ABV of a wine, a very good wine. You get the spiciness from the rye, some sweetness and, and toffee from the, the malt. But it's touches of vanilla and bits and pieces, it smells vanilla and maybe a bit of oak. Barrel aged, which could very well be oak. Oh, aged in Tres Hombres rum barrels for 123 days. Okay, let's dive in, cheers. Stone the Crows, that is incredible. One incredible beer, even for the morning. You could really, you could feel the, a little touch of the alcohol burn going down, but it's got a very good mouthfeel. Toffee, spicy rye. It's just lovely. It's just a really, really good beer. The toffee that's coming through, the, the density from the mouthfeel, the good carbonation in there, just to give it a lift. It pushes the beer around the inside of the mouth. Vanilla, rum, oak, woodiness. Ah, the raisin, the plum, the fig. I'll mention it again, the spicy rye, it's an absolutely, absolutely fantastic beer. The plum, there's a prominent plum flavour there. It's just great. It's the great beer. So, uh, Joppen and Lervig. Uh, the barrel aged at Joppen, we are continuing continually innovating and pushing boundaries with these limited edition beers we celebrate the art of barrel aging. This barrel aged series allows us to explore the effects of time, the spirits leave behind their own personality. Uh, rye wine carefully aged in rum barrels adding freshness to an elegant warm finish. Coconut means meets candy, vanilla and light caramel. Absolutely. You do get coconut. I've mentioned the vanilla and I've mentioned that kind of toffee caramel flavour. Uh, Lervig, Joppen, don't rye this at home or try this at home. Barrel aged rye wine. Let's give it a rating. I'm going to rate it and I'm going to give it. Wah. I'm going to give it a smashing, smashing Stone the Crows 9 out of 10. It's a 9 out of 10 from Milo Craft Beer. Please put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe to our daily beer reviews. Give us a big fat thumbs up.
Goodbye Vlatsav 2017, what a wonderful stadium, what a wonderful beer festival. It kind of just, well you can see it's a huge beer festival that almost circulates the whole of the stadium. So thanks for watching, comment, subscribe, give us a big fat thumbs up, boom and cheers.